Hey, if you want to plot multiple axes in MATLAB graph, then this is the right video for you. Here in this video, we'll learn how to plot two different data range graphs like this into a single graph with two axes like this. So now, without wasting time, let's quickly start the session. Hey, this is Budraj and you're watching Learning Vibes and welcome to another video on video lecture series on MATLAB tutorial. First of all, I would like to write these two lines. And now we'll begin with our program. So now I'm going to write the data range for our graph. And there we go. Uh, this is the x-axis from 0 to 2 pi on the step size of 0 0.01. y1 is a sine function of x and y2 is a cos function of x but it is 19 times right so obviously the data range for vertical axis for both this graph is different uh, we can say that y2 is 19 times larger than y1 let me show you these two separate graph and then we'll see how we can add up these two together so i'll simply write plot for both the graphs there we go plot x y1 and we'll hold on the value in same graph we'll plot x y2 and let's run it but we have not saved this file so when we run it it will ask us to save so we'll give the name multi-axis matlab plot and we'll save over here we'll add to path and there we go so the problem is clearly visible this data range is so large that the variation in the first graph, right, x versus y1, it's not clearly visible. So to clearly visualize the differences in, you know, maximum value, minimum value, positive, negative, and all those things, we need to separate those axes because the difference in to the vertical data range of both these graphs is very large. So we'll close it. Now we do not require this hold on. What we'll do, write the command yy axis left. So this graph we are going to plot on left hand side. And this one on right hand side. So the axis of this graph will be on left hand side and the axis of this graph will be on right hand side. And now let's run it again. And now you can see the blue one, the axis of this blue graph is on left hand side and the axis of this orange one is on right hand side. Let me do small variations over here. So uh, I have increased the line width. So now it's more appropriate to see, right? If you want to give the access property and title, you can give it over here. And let's run it. And this is how its amplitude of y1, its amplitude of y2, time and sine and cos function. Oh, I have written it not appropriately. It should be like this function. Right? So this is how you can plot multiple axes in MATLAB graph. If you want to learn anything more on MATLAB, you can write that thing in comments below and I'll try to make video on that topic. This video is a part of MATLAB tutorial video lecture series and the link for that full playlist is provided in description box below. So that's all from this video and we'll meet you in next video. So until we meet again in our next video, till the time, bye bye.